How you doing, folks? I'm just going to go ahead and jump right into this. Um, get us started. I've already uh, started the recording here because I want to get the mega boxes uh, sliced open. So we're going to go ahead and just start getting all this stuff taken care of. That way, by the time uh, most of us get in here at noon, we'll be ready to rock and roll. How's everyone's weekend so far? What's up, Troy? Big morning for you, man. Steve, how's it hanging? Always first to say hello. Like that. So Troy, tell me about these uh, these negative things that you've said about me. I read, I read on the uh, the internet that you may have said negative things about me, but now I, I've been forgiven. <laughs> What's up, Abe? We did last time. The first thing that we're going to open is going to be the, uh, the crummy mega box packs. Get them out of the way. too much to ask for, Steve. I think I can do that. Maybe hit your mega box order or something. Or a little uh, sapphire purple. Pulled a lot of Abrams in uh, mega box prior to this. I think we hit two autos of him in the same round. I think that was one of the times I... Uh, I went straight prognosticator. It's like, oh, the only way to make this break better for the Padres is to hit an Abrams numbered auto. And then we hit an Abrams numbered auto like the next box. <laughs> So I think I'm going to do it a little bit different this time. Um, since I have all the Mega Box stuff out, I think I'm just going to start. Um, well, I'll start with, obviously, the uh, the annoying Mega Box packs, and then we'll we'll just move right into the Mega Box since it's already uh, out and open. And then we'll go into Hobby, and then we'll go into uh, to Sapphire. Oof. 
Man. All right. 6 a.m. My goodness. Well, thanks for waking up, Brandon. Damn. 6 a.m. I hope you got some good players that are worth it losing sleep. All right. I'm going to go ahead and just get right into it. Um, stack these. Guys. So nothing really to uh, nothing really to report here for uh, for this break as far as rules or anything go. Uh, no team list or anything to do. If you uh, need to reference uh, anything regarding what players you have, it's all in the thread. Um, I'll do my best. Uh, probably just based off the last round of this, I I don't know. I don't think I'll be able to get um, everything out tomorrow just based on how long it takes to uh, package and sort. But I'll do my best. I might be able to get some out. Um, and those of you that were in um, Chronicles Soccer, um, there's only four of you that were in that break that are also in this break. Um, I have that set aside, so those will fit together for you. Um, other things to note is uh, current breaks filling right now, if anyone is interested. We have Select Soccer, which is just under halfway full. We have three rounds of Prism Football. Uh, it's a mixer between 19 uh, Hobby and 18 White Sparkles. Um, those are combined between all three rounds. I think we're like at like 57% full. Um, the first round's at like 60-something, and the other two are right at 50%. Uh, there's a Walking Dead break up that's uh, very cheap. I don't think that's going to fill, though. And so, and then the other one is uh, National Treasures Collegiate Basketball, a random serial number break for uh, a case. Also cheap. It's like under $20 a spot. Uh, high risk, but there's about, I think there's... I think there's 10, 10 or 11 cards of box in that, so um, not you know not impossible to hit. And uh, you can get some really cool stuff. I actually have like I think I have like five cards from that set in my personal collection. Uh, oddly enough, because I don't really like collegiate stuff, but um, you can get some really cool stuff. Notable nickname set. Um, Tony Gwynn has basketball um, autos and auto relics, which are cool. Uh, they got the flawless diamonds, so some neat stuff. It's some really cool patches and bookings. Um, so if you're interested in any of that stuff, please sign up. And if anyone has any recommendations for what they'd like to see open, uh, let me know. I'm always always on the lookout for uh, for some new products that we haven't put up yet. Um, I was thinking about a round three for this, Abe. Um, i got to run the pricing again because um, I know Sapphire boxes went up. Um, I think they're up to like $5.50 a box now. So um, we might have to tweak things a little bit to keep it at the same price point or uh, you know, it might go up by a couple dollars a spot. But I'll play with it and uh, see what I can make work. As long as it's not like uh, something ridiculous where we have to you know, ditch like a third of the product to keep this, the prices the same. Um, but you know, it always gets to a point with stuff like uh, Sapphire where it gets so high you just kind of got to back off and try and find something else, I guess. So hopefully we're not there yet. But mega boxes are still uh they were still at fifty bucks, which is a good value because we can always add those into um to bring more content. I mean it's not nearly as good as Sapphire, but you know. It's a very nice, good, cheap alternative. And I think we're gonna put up another Chronicles, uh Chronicles Soccer. As the price only went up just a little bit since the last round for that one, and a uh, very good break. So, a lot of fun, filled very fast, so. <laughs> Hi, Brandon. That's, that's the attitude I like. No one's special until we hit their uh, Pad Paragia, and then you're a big fan of, like, uh, you know, Dane Dunning all of a sudden. I'll explain, um, again, for those of you that were not in round one of this, I'll explain what's going to happen um, with the Bowman Hobby stuff and the Mega Box Packs when we get to it as far as the draftable spots and all that stuff. But for right now, it is about as straightforward as it gets. All the Chrome cards will ship to the player spots.
All right. Let's see if we can get a couple nice uh, big name chromes here. Uh, looks like here in this stack, I don't know if you guys can see it. Looks like a bunch of the cards are damaged. Eh, not a bunch. Doesn't look like it's the chrome, it's the paper. See this? Looks like a set of the packs might have got like caught in something. They are. It's definitely not straight, but. As long as it's not the chromes, not a big deal. I don't see any issues with the chromes in the stack. Wow, it's like on all of the, uh, it's on a lot of them, but it's not the chromes, it's just the paper. So, all right. Singer and Joe Ryan, Dunning and Waters, Howard and Stott, Ashby and Nova, Manoa and Pache, Wynn and Gilbert. Cantillo and Rushman. Marquez and Pearson. Carlson and Kirilov. Shortridge and McConnell. Anderson and Encarnacion. Boz, Glen Allen Hill Jr. Rushman and Poisson. Nice one there. Marquez and Gray. Valamont and White. Rollison and Mateo. Adele and Whitley. Bart and Thomas. Groshans Cabello. Rutherford Lynch. Waters Bojarski. Howard Manoa. Pache and Huff, Wynn and Cantillo, uh, Rushman Marquez, Gray Poisson, so two Robbie Poiss. There we go, nice Dominguez Chrome. It's a good start for you, Troy. A little bonus Dominguez Chrome. Balazovich, Kate and Rutledge, Carlson Kirilov. Shortridge Little, Anderson Encarnacion, Bennett and Little, Luciano and Thompson, Wilson and Casas, Witt and Trammell. So one Witt, one Dominguez, and two Poisson so far. Let's see if we can get a Laura to round out the uh, foursome. Floriel and Robert, Langoliers Gonzalez, Chisholm Mitchell, Whole Sizer Pardino, Rushman Krause, that's like the fifth Rushman, I feel like. Marquez Gray. And last little bit. Cardenas Levine, Bishop Mata, and last one, Manning and Ruiz. All right, so that's going to do it for the Chrome uh, Paper Whatever Packs. I'm going to call them for Megabox, the non-Megabox and Megabox packs. So let's move on to the actual Megabox packs. Hoping for at least uh, one auto. I think odds-wise we uh, should be expecting two. Pink to 199 and an orange in here as well. I think oranges are orange is 25 in this one. Yeah. So that could be nice. Don't know if there's any autos yet, but I can see the color peeking out at me. Another numbered something there. Alright, so it's looking like three numbered cards in this first stack, no autos. Maybe an auto? Four. Four numbered cards. We got the, the good old back-to-back -back numbered card, the base and the insert. All right, good luck, guys. Diaz, Encarnacion, 
Uh, so this is going to be for the draftable spot. Um, all the rookie card logo and prospect inserts that are not part of BP 1 to 150 will become one spot, including the parallels. So that's where that is going. Pearson, Jones, Wade, Dunning, Yamamoto, rookie of their favorites, Green, Bennett, Singer, and Eric Pardino spanning the globe blue. So he is in the prospect set. So that goes to the Pardino spot. And a Casey Mize, purple, 3 of 250. Cabello, Ashby, Mauricio, uh, Abrams, Abraham Toro, Davidson, J-Rod, Liberator, Kate, Anders Munoz, Lodolo, Henderson, Amaya, Robinson, Kyle Lewis, Baum, McConnell, Vargas, Pereira, and our orange is... Jesus Sanchez for the Marlins, 1 of 25. Nice Sanchez. Levine, Adaman, Kalenic, Jung, Savale, Baum, McConnell, Amayo, Robinson, Franco, uh, spanning the globe insert. Levine, Adaman, Brown, Garcia, Yamamoto, Belazovich, Varlin, Franco, and... Fr wow, a lot of, a lot of Wander Franco there. Franco insert, Franco base, and now Franco spanning the globe pink to 199. So, nice hit there. Paredes, Poisson, and Rushman. So that was pretty nice. Second stack. Finish off uh, the Mega Box section of the break. There's an auto. All right, got at least one. purple, two purple, a green, three purples, a green, and an auto, it looks like. All right. Huff, Hankins, Mize, Valamont, Sejas, Cruz, Shortridge, Yamamoto insert, Apostle, Amaya, Hill, Manning, and a purple. There's a nice one. Guy I always seem to pull, Xavier Edwards. Non-stop Xavier Edwards. Uh, 64 of 250. Nice wit, which means there's a Dominguez. There you go, Troy. Encarnacion, Huff, Puck, rookie of your favorites, Sejas, Adele, Hankins, Ruiz, and another purple, uh, Pache, 66 of 250. Jones, Hose, Shortridge, Hill. And for the insert spot, this is going to be the draftable spot, Jesus Lazardo Green, 79 of 99, rookie of the year favorites. Savale, Gonzalez, Manning, Kirilov, Lazardo, spanning the globe, that's going to go to the insert spot. Uh, Adams, Madrigal, Amaya, Robinson, Puck, McConnell, Levine, Vargas, Pereira will save the auto. Adam and Hayes, Howard, Floriel, Seth Brown, Chisholm, Trammell, Casas, Whitley, and a Ryan Mountcastle. I pull a lot of Orioles, like so many Orioles. 132 of 250 between him, Henderson, Adam Hall, uh, Manoa, and Gorman. And our auto... Color, color, color. No, it looks like it's base. Aha, guy we pull a lot of as well. It's like the third or fourth Brandon Shoemake Mega Box auto. So this will be drafted, draftable uh, auto. Brandon Shoemake. Braden Shoemake, excuse me. Not Brandon, Braden. All right. Gonna move on to the hobby boxes now after I take another slug of my coffee. A little agua. Very good stuff. Okay. Hobby box number one. Numero uno.
go through. I'll stack them all up, and then we'll run through everything. So again, same concept as the Mega Box stuff here. Um, any card doesn't matter if it's an insert or a chrome um, or an autograph. If the player is in BP one to one fifty, it goes to the player spot. If it, uh, if it is not BP one to one fifty, um, if it's a player not in that set, it'll be going to one of the draftable spots. For hobby, there's three different draftable spots. Um, it's going to be all the autographs which will be drafted individually. It's going to be um, any veteran and rookie card logo parallels and inserts. That includes um, any number of refractors of those guys as well. And then the last one will be the same thing of all the prospects and the talent pipeline cards. And then uh, paper parallels, anyone, any uh, veterans or rookie card logos will be uh, the third spot. So those are your three draftable spots. Paper parallels, rookie card logo and veteran inserts, and then prospect inserts. And then obviously the autographs. I think we wound up with uh, 15 draftable spots, so it was 11 total autos and uh, and uh, four um, four insert insert spots. So we'll do that random at the end of the break. Once we figure out how many spots there are, um, always just note that uh, I separate them as we go for that stuff. So there is a chance I uh, I mean I doubt it, but though there's always a chance that I make a mistake, I miss an auto or um, or put it in with the uh, the one to one fifty spot. So all right, Mauricio and Davis, Horner insert, Gorman and Green, Munoz insert, Mendoza and Hose, Mac Mun Max Muncy insert. Green and Cabello. There's a nice Dominguez, top 100. Freeman and Garcia. Patino insert. Davidson and Kraus. Scherzer insert. Hayes Levine. Pipeline for the Mets. Madrigal Adaman. Top 100 of Alec Thomas. Denneberg and Casas. Welker and our Atomic is Casey Mize. So that's two Casey Mize parallels already. Uh, rookie, their favorites of Dustin May. J Rod and Whitley. Top 100 of Usenel Diaz. Lutz and Beer. Third stack. Paper Vet. Brian Reynolds, 23 of 150. Blade and Mountcastle, Kirilov, Hankins and Cameron, Yu Chang, Rookie Card Logo, India and Vargas, ooh, Insert Auto, Insert Auto, what do we got here? That's nice, Bobby Dahlbeck, Top 100, 48 of 50. Nice doll deck. This is like his 9,000th prospect year uh, card. Pretty sure doll deck's in the regular set. Um, Gil and Allen. Forrest Whitley. Javier and Astudillo. Joe Adele. Amaya and Paredes. Anyone want to just confirm? Doll deck is in the regular set, right? The 1 to 150. I'm like pretty sure, but I don't want to say for certain because like I said, he's in every prospect set ever I feel like for the past five years, so 
I could just be thinking of something else. Uh, Kyle Lewis, Rookie of the Year favorites. Reese Hines and Hernandez, talent pipeline of the Dodgers. Zach Brown and Damon Jones. Top 100 of Dylan Carlson. Swaggerty and Hill. Top 100 of Braylon Marquez. There's a nice one. Riley Green Gold, 28 of 50. Going out to the Riley Green spot. I think that's you, Abe. Riley Green. Thank you, by the way, Abe. I was 99% sure. Just wanted to double check. Baz and Garcia. Cannon Smith. And also for Abe, Wilfred Astudillo, purple to 250. Nate Pearson. Adam Hall. Matthew Liberatore. It's going to finish off box number one. Box number two. Back to back parallels for you there. Pretty solid. I haven't had an insert auto out of hobby in a long time. We had a lot in the jumbos uh, that we opened a couple months ago, but I think we only had one. That's maybe the second insert auto out of, I don't know now, probably close to eight cases, seven cases of hobby. If I can recall, might have been another one, but there was. I don't remember it. Oh, what's going on with these wrappers? Like I said, I'll check on a round three for you guys for this. Um, probably tomorrow. I'm going to be busy today with uh, sorting and doing what I can to get um, everything ready to ship. Possibly tomorrow, likely on Tuesday. Uh, there's just too many different packages for, uh, for me to tell you. Especially on a, on a Monday where I have a, you know, an entire weekend's worth of eBay shipping that I have to do before I can get to any of this. Watching so much soccer. So much soccer, man. Watching, uh, I don't even know who's playing right now. Sampadorio and Parma, someone. Calcio, I think. Game that means literally almost nothing. One team is going, they're just in the middle of the table, and the other one is like, Take like a miracle for them to get relegated. So they're just kind of going through the motions. All right. It's like a week 16 matchup between like two teams that can't make the playoffs in the NFL. All right, here we go. Pipeline of the Nats. Trammell and Scooble. Lade. Adele and Lodolo. Bart and Nova. Bobby Witt Jr. Very nice. Thomas and Ryan. Spanning the globe of Franco, Groshans and Stott, and Spencer Howard, Matt Manning, and McConnell. Sean Murphy, rookie card logo. Witt and Poisson, nice little pack there. Terang, and we got an orange. First Bowman. Ooh, I know who it is. It's going to be good. Boom. There you go, Abe. Volpe. 15 to 25. Orange Volpe. Nice hit. Very nice hit. Uh, it's possible. It'd be expensive to do all Sapphire, um, but it's definitely possible. Rushman. 
Bennett and Jones. And our auto, Alvaro Sejas. Sejas, so he is in the uh, set. Luciano and Adams. Cabrian Hayes. I don't think Cabrian Hayes is in the set. I'll double check though later. Thompson and Bojarski. Miguel Amaya. Wilson and Huff. It's funny, some of these guys that have been prospects forever. I literally can't remember if uh, they're in the set or not. I'm just so used to seeing their name. Gavin Lux, rookie card logo. Sanchez and Hernandez. Sejas and Grant Little. Our Atomic for this box. Alvarez, rookie of the year favorites. Ramos and Jones. Jake Cave, Hidden Finds. Tavares and Hill. Carter Keyboom. That's a weird one. So it doesn't have the rookie card logo, even though it should. There were a couple of that were like this that I noticed last time. So it's going to go with the prospects because it doesn't have the rookie card logo. Because he's technically got a rookie card logo last year. But he didn't play enough games to unqualify from the prospects. So it's weird. I don't know if he's a veteran, a rookie, God knows. But there's no rookie card logo, so he's going in the prospect set. Uh, Dominguez for Troy, Mountcastle, Casey Mize spanning the globe, Balazovic and Cameron, Dylan Carlson, Josh Jung and Vargas, Pipeline of the Red Sox, Henderson and Beck, Royce Lewis. Miller and White. There's a nice one. Luis Robert. 174 of 499. So that will go to the Luis Robert spot, as noted. Um, any Luis Roberts go to the Luis, eh, Luis Robert spot. Hoke and Pardino. Jordan Yamamoto. Schmidt and Gonzalez. Isaac Paredes. Rodriguez and Sanchez. And that's going to do it for box two. Moving on to box three. I get so distracted by soccer when I'm breaking. I'm just like, I just need live sports so bad though in my life. I forget that I'm supposed to be talking to you guys. I'm just sitting here staring, watching, you know, some dumb dumb midfielder just make a run into no into nowheresville. That results in just a, a you know a nothing play, a clear. Well, you guys are just sitting here watching me <laughs> open packs, not even speaking to you. What the heck am I doing? Very unprofessional on my end. But we're only only a week away from baseball, so that'll that should be able to uh, quell any issues that I'm having. It's crazy that there's gonna be no minors. Like, what's that gonna do to the development of some of these guys? Make it difficult to prospect, that's for sure. Alright, 
Here we go. First stack. Box trace. Bomb. Insert. Lewis and Beck. Bomb again. And Pardino. So we had a Pardino numbered card, and now we've got a Pardino atomic. Brendan McKay, rookie card logo. Laura and Witt, that's our first Laura sighting. Duran Hidden Finds. Valamont Pardino. Madrigal. Rollison and Oscar Gonzalez. Lazardo. Cavaco and Sanchez. Uh, Nolan Gorman. Mateo and McConnell. Pipeline of the Reds. Holesizer and Jones. Evan White. Floriel and Adams. Robert Bojarski. Aquino. Uh, rookie card logo. Huff and Langoliers. Hernandez spanning the globe. Chisholm. Poisson. It's like the fifth Poisson, I think. So, pretty good start for the Poisson spot. O'Neill Cruz insert, Mitchell and Scoobs, Tim Kate, and a blue shimmer of Matthew Lee Barator. 145 of 150. Juan Soto insert, Carlson and Lodolo, and our auto going to the Oscar Gonzalez spot. Nice first Bowman. He was a uh, Supplemental first or second rounder last year. Nope, made that up. Signed as a free agent. I thought the Indians signed. No, that was the other guy. Uh, Eric. Eric someone, right? Didn't the Indians draft like two, two infielders, like, or three infielders back to back to back in 2019, like all like in the end of the first or into the middle of the second rounds? Could have swore they did. I might be losing my mind, though. Kirilov and Nova. Helio Ramos, Shortridge and Ryan, Balazovic spanning the globe, Encarnacion and Stott. Who the heck was it? I know I had one of them in Bowman Draft Sapphire. The break. I thought his name was Eric something. I don't, I don't know. Can't think right now. Need more coffee. Oh. Forgot this stack here. My bad, guys. Lazardo, <laughs> rookie card logo. Anderson and Gilbert. Pipeline of the Rays. Franco and Pearson. Corbin Carroll. Uh, top 100. Ashby and Diaz. Kalanick and Ruiz. Bogarts insert. Campusano and Amaya. Matthew Lugo spanning the globe. I don't think he is. Singer and Varland. And now we're done with box three. On to box four. And if you guys haven't done so already, please give me a follow here on the channel. I uh, certainly appreciate that. Getting close to uh, 300 followers. And I'm going to be getting video editing software so I can make my stuff look nice. I'm going to mess around with some of it uh, maybe later today, depending on how much I can get done. What up, Kev? Welcome. Welcome to the chat.
We're on uh, box four here of Hobby. Already did the Mega Box, so knock those out. I think we're going a little bit faster than last time. Uh, nothing huge to speak of so far. Best auto, I believe, was probably, uh, just, I don't know, no really, no really good autos to speak of. We hit uh, Oscar Gonzalez. I don't know why I put that over there. Uh, Oscar Gonzalez. Um, a Brandon Shoemake Mega Box auto and a Dahlbeck. The Dahlbeck number to 50. The insert auto is probably our best one. Um, who was the other auto from Hobby? I can't even remember. But our best card was probably a Volpe Orange to 25 non-auto. So, All right, Murphy, Rookie of the Year favorites. Sanchez and Beck. Gavin Lux, Rookie Card logo insert. Another Dominguez, very nice. Sanchez as well. Franco spanning the globe. Balazovic and McConnell. And... Glenn Allen Hill Jr., another guy I pull a lot of, it seems like. This feels that way. Glenn Allen Hill Jr. So that is going to the Glenn Allen Hill Jr. spot. Garcia and Mountcastle. Taylor Trammell. Mize and Cameron. Miguel Amaya uh, insert. Dahlbeck and Varvik, uh, Vargas. Oof, Vargas. <laughs> a Starlin Castro. Sky Blue to 499, so that's gonna go to the draftable spot. Abrams and Astudio, Yamamoto rookie card logo insert, Cruz and Paredes, Paredes spanning the globe, Apostle Hernandez, Gus Varlin hidden finds, Gray and Davis, Tony Gonsolin rookie card logo insert, Cardenas and Green, Casey Mize spanning the globe, Bishop and Hose. Uh, Jordan Alvarez rookie card logo, Marquez and Beer, <clears throat> Torres insert, Mata and Garcia, Pipeline for the Ra uh, Royals, Peña and Liberator, Hans Kraus, I don't think he's in the set, Vaughn Allen, uh, George Valera, Cantillo and Adaman, Rushman, and a Travis Swaggerty, Atomic, Murphy and Greaterall. Last stack here in box four. Pipeline for the Cubs. Sejas and White. Oh, that was our other auto. Sejas. Alvaro Sejas. Patino insert. Ramos and Pardino. CJ Abrams insert. Cal Mitchell to 499. Edwards and Jones. Christian Robinson and Mason Denenberg Aqua. 39 of 125. Dane, honestly, I've never done video editing outside of like 10 years ago um, when I used to like mess around with iMovie on my Mac when I first started doing group breaks, so I have no idea. Um, it doesn't look like it's going to be fun, but I'm going to keep it very simple. I just want to be able to uh, have like a cover page instead of like my videos just having like a thumbnail. Um, so that's, that's the main thing that I want. Uh, Cease, rookie card logo insert. Volpe and Hill. Tavares and Gonzalez. So we'll see how it goes. Might be might be terrible. I don't know. But I mean, don't think for a second I'm gonna be looking like some crazy like uh one of these like YouTube like superstar like quality like vloggers where they cut and edit everything. I, none of that. Nah. -uh. Uh, no thank you. <laughs> but Hans Kraus does have a Chrome. All right. Hans Kraus does have a Chrome. Move him over. Thank you for that, Kevin. Thanks for the prospect. I mean, they're like so interchangeable, guys like that. To me, like, I don't know, he had a Chrome? Can't remember. I opened so much Bowman stuff, you know, between this and Draft and then Sapphire. And I think I do a pretty good job of keeping track. But every once in a while, a guy like that, hands crowds, kind of forgettable, you know? Although I wasn't saying that back when I had his, uh, I pulled like a silhouette patch auto of him to like maybe 20 or something from like 2016 Stars and Stripes Baseball. And I was like, oh, this Hans Kraus guy, he's supposed to be good. I like this. He was interesting to me then, not, not so much anymore.
buckets. Maybe, uh, I don't know, they're calling for offside. I don't know. Sampadorio tied it at two, maybe. Looks like a good goal from here. Let's see. Oh, uh, own, little own goal, little deflection. But yeah, it's good. Definitely gonna count. I feel like the second own goal in this match. Just tried to flick it over the keeper, just clipped off someone's dome real fast, but. Oh, like. Well, it's funny you say that, Kev. What's up, Curtis? Um, Rangers pissed pitching prospects. The one prospect that I can think of that I like, I truly whiffed on um, because they were not good, not because they got hurt. I mean, that's nothing I can do about that. Um, but the one pitching prospect, the one actually real prospect that I just completely missed on was a Rangers pitcher. Um, he was awesome. He was dirt cheap. So a later round pick, but he would strike people out. And then he, he moved up. And so I want to say it was high class A, and the guy just could not throw a strike. He, I'm no joking. I think in his first like five starts, he gave up like 48 runs with like 51 walks and 20 wild pitches. It was a uh, Cody Buckle. Literally just couldn't pitch. Just couldn't couldn't pitch. It was unbelievable. Um, but it's funny they say that too because Cole Win, I got Cole Win last year in our player. 20 case, random, 10 case, I don't even know what it was. I was like, oh, this guy's got a shot. Or I drafted him. I was like, he's got a shot. You know, he hasn't pitched yet because he had Tommy John or whatever. And then he came back and literally the same thing, just couldn't throw a strike. And he was, uh, I think he was a first rounder, um, end of the first round. Just couldn't throw a strike. Just couldn't do it. <laughs> All right. Box five, our final hobby box before we move on to Sapphire. Spencer Howard, Rodriguez and Scoobal, Henderson and Miguel Amaya Sapphire, or, uh, excuse me, Atomic, Aaron Savale, rookie card logo, Tavares and Adams, Goldschmidt Hidden Finds, Miller and Bojarski, and we got another orange, me a non auto. Ooh, it's an insert. Nice. This is going to go to the Nolan Gorman spot. Look at that. That's a nice card. I really like these. The color versions of uh, the 1990 Bowmans. They look sharp. Very clean. So, Nolan Gorman, 20 of 25. Nice hit for the Gorman spot. Adele. Hoke and Huff. Pardino. Schmidt. Poisson again. A lot, of, a lot of Robbie Poiss. Pipeline of the Yankees. Manning and Lodolo. Sanchez, Terang and Nova, Bennett and Ryan, Gavin Lux rookie card logo, Luciano and Stott, Helio Ramos, Thompson and Gilbert, Nate Pearson, Jung and Jones, yeah, very sharp looking for sure, Tyler Freeman, Wilson and Pearson. We got a gold shimmer coming up. Nice box here for color. Bobby Witt. Oh, if only that was the gold shimmer. Good luck, guys. Gold shim shim. Ah, one of the pros I've been a prospect forever prospects. Ian Anderson for the Braves. Uh, I don't have anything here for personals today for uh, Bowman stuff. Everything I have here is already allotted for the uh, the group breaks, Curtis. Kalenic, Trammell and Diaz. And... Very colorful box. Ruben Cardenas, 47 of 50 gold auto. So two autos to 50 in the uh, the hobby portion here. So that's a nice hit. Not the best player in the world, but gold autos are never bad, especially when they're the first Bowmans. Adele and Ruiz. Uh, Vidal Brujan. Is Brujan in the set? I think he is. I think he is. Bart and Amaya. Robert spanning the globe. Thomas and Varland. 
He's another one of those guys. Just can't remember. Alzalay, Groshans and Duran. Pipeline for the Phils. Rutherford de la Cruz. Ronnie Mauricio. Lynch and Perez. Cavico and Pereira. Joe Adele insert. Goran Rutledge. Desan Brown spanning the globe. And Montero and Little is going to do it for the hobby portion. So give me a second to clean up here, guys. Move this stuff off the table. And we'll get into Sapphire, the good stuff. Not in the set. What is Bruhan in? I could have, is he in the auto set? He's in the auto set. That's what it is. It's like I know he has cards in here, right? Oh, since that's probably sitting right on top, I'm just going to move it now so I don't forget to do so later. You in with the draftable homies. Right, guys let's do it sapphire I'll go one by one on these because they're more fun sapphire is fun I like sapphire I get so excited opening sapphire stuff just the uh, the possibility of just drilling the like pad garage or Dominguez auto just gets me amped up good luck guys all right first card was good <laughs> I love when that happens Duolingo wants me to take more Spanish lessons. Like, hi, it's Duolingo. It's time for Spanish. I know it's time, guys. Come on. But I'm on camera right now. Who do you got, Kev? Oh, Sampadoria, another goal. Look at them go. Is that Bonazelli again? Because he had some wicked goals uh, when I was watching the other day. That is him. That's my guy. Federico Bonazzoli. He scored some really silly goals, and now I like him. It doesn't have any cards, though, except for stickers. I don't like those. All right, here we go. Box one. Lutz, Edwards, Jones, Whitley, Cardenas, Rutherford, Hose. Very nice. Laura. Casas, Manoa, Sejas, Bennett, Adele, Gorman, Manning, Waters, Kalenic, Hill, White, Smith, Blade, Davidson, Stott, and the first card that I saw... From Sapphire, boom. Robert. Luis Robert. Luciano, De La Cruz, Ramos, and our orange is... Another nice one for Abe. Second orange Volpe. Sapphire's a 75, though, but still a very, very nice card. 
and I'm gonna do it. I'll just do it. I'll pull it, okay? Fine, I'll pull it. I don't care. You think I won't? Jung, Little, Varland, and... Ha! That's how I roll. You ask me for something, and I just deliver. Okay, Kev? Boom. <laughs> I love when that happens. Not good players. I just need to hit, get a card of them now. All right, there's a Blade, and there's the Cantillo. Just check it off the list. Who's next? Actually, <laughs> I think I'll. Uh, I think what I'm gonna do for Sapphire is I'm just gonna pull the uh, the couple big big guys, the four biggins. Well, five if you count. No, yeah, four. The four big guys. And then the autos. Do a little mini recap at the end. Just the sapphire stuff. See, braved him. That is... Yeah, getting a little greedy there. Ask for someone else, Abe. Come on. Two Volpe oranges already. <laughs> We're not even into the good stuff. We're one box into the good stuff. Ask for a different player. Although I do pull a lot of Volpe. He's another one of the guys, like... Here I am through, like, you know, I don't know, hundreds of boxes combined between Sapphire and regular Bowman, and there's still guys that I haven't seen their autos of, but there's other players where I'm on, like, six, seven, eight, ten copies... You guys know who one of them is. If we go the whole break without hitting one of him, I'll do a shot on camera. I'll probably just chug a whole bottle on camera. I don't even care. All right. Rutherford, Casas, Baum, Davis, Manoa, Adele, Swaggerty, Rollison, Gorman, Varlin, Gray, Lewis, Kalenic, Hill, Sanchez, Marquez, Blade, Davidson, Bobby Witt. Nice. Valmont, Rushman, Campusano, Miller, and Ashby. Parallel is an orange. Gavico, Dalazovic, Cardenas. Are they not upside down this time? Okay. Well, two for two, not upside down. This time it's a pitcher. Dalazovic. Jordan Dalazovic, 64 of 75. Twinkies. And our auto. Denneberg, Levine, Ramos, and Dieselbel Arias. So, first Bowman auto. Not a great one, but we still got 13 more boxes to go, so we eye. Oh, it's Gervinho. I pulled a gold of him yesterday. Look at that. What's up, Gervinho? I remember you from the 2014 World Cup. Don't say his name. No, Kevin. It's like Candyman. If you say it three times, he's going to just show up. Don't do it. We got a purple. Maybe this is three straight boxes that we've had the uh, Rushman Blade run. And there's our auto. So three boxes, three parallels. Cardenas, Miller, Ashby, Rutherford, Casas, Cruz, Volpe, Manoa, Adele, Gill, Thomas, Gorman, Varlin, Franco, Welker, Hill, Ramos, Dalzovich, Baum, Blade, Davidson, Davis, and Swaggerty. Purple, the 20. Uh, Gray, Rollison, Rushman. Hmm, I think I know who it is. Yep. Austin Beck. 7 of 20, another guy I pull. For someone who doesn't, I don't think he has an auto. I pull a lot of his parallels. 7 of 20 on Austin Beck. Purple. Ruiz, Cavico, Kalenic, and... Fucking A, man. Kevin, this is your fault. This is all on you. We're feuding, you and I, for the next 
seven, seven to eight seconds here until the steam releases from my ears, until all of it's out. When it all gets out, we'll be, we'll be boys again. We'll be cotton on a lamb, all right? But for now... Okay, moving on. <laughs> yeah, the uh, I I was shocked by the way when I uh, looked up what someone paid for his first two Sapphire autos. They paid like forty bucks, it was like forty or fifty bucks for the. Uh, the, the base, Janora Sapphire. And I was like, what the f*** is going on? Like, it has to be just be like someone just, you know, like, someone had to buy it now and then someone else was like, oh, I need a Joe Janora for my Mets collection and only one is sold at 50 bucks, so I guess it's worth 50, you know? Kind of like one of those, like, uh, like chain reactions. And I actually had to rank that card at number one last time. I think it's probably like an $80 card. At least until people, like, you know, until, like, common sense comes o uh, takes over and the market corrects itself, but... So, like, it could be worse, but, man, what, like, an absolute waste of a green auto is correct. That is an immediate sell now, never look back. Like, I don't know if it's like I'm like happy to sad. Like usually I'm 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 sad that it's you know like it's a waste of our green auto. But like I, I guess like if you're gonna hit a Joe Janord, you might as well have it be the parallel so you get more for it. But I'd rather if we're only gonna get three green autos, I don't want one of them to be him. You know, so kind of bittersweet. Dominguez just depends on how you want to look at it, I guess. First Dominguez, so congratulations, Troy. There you go. You're on the board. Uh, Rodriguez, Hope, Kate, Valamont, Miller, Cabello, Brown, Ashby, Cruz, Cameron, Hankins, Volpe, Gill, Madrigal, Kirilov, Thomas, Franco, Vargas, Green, Welker, Ruiz, Allen, Encarnacion, Cavico, Balazovic, Hayes, and Robbie Plas. Nice little box there. <laughs> Freaking Joe Janord, man. Unbelievable. Mice, Garcia, Hernandez, and there's a nice one. Who's got the Brennan Davis spot? Boom. That's a big one. Big card there. Like, why couldn't that be the green? Awesome hit. Brennan Davis. Much better. What a turnaround from the Joe Janor debacle. Alright, box five of Sapphire. while we're uh, going through this stuff um, like I said I, I want to do a round three of this um, but we're going to have to either make we're going to have to make some kind of small change because uh, I think the sapphire boxes went up by like 30 or 40 bucks a box um, so would you guys rather me cut out a little bit of product like maybe like knock it down to like you know 12 sapphire boxes or cut out like you know a sapphire and a hobby and like a couple megas and keep the spot price around the same or would you rather keep the uh, amount of product around the same and it, you know it might be like five five bucks extra a spot what would you guys prefer if i given the choice uh floriel jones cantillo howard whitley hose rutledge schmidt laura little baby Sejas, Bojarski, Gore, Bennett, Manning, Pena, Abrams, Waters, Jung, Robinson, Liberator, Smith, Luciano, Chisholm, and John Diaz. Orange. Uh, Henderson, Groshans, Little, and Glenn Allen Hill Jr. I told you I pull this guy a lot. Pull him a lot. Yeah, no problem. Uh, Brandon, I can take care of that for you. It's a little bit of a complicated break, uh, this one. Um, not very 
not, not normal at all. It kind of combined uh, two things and made up my own uh, my own format here just to kind of give a little bit of value. So cut out the mega. Well, the megas aren't that expensive, Kev. Like all the megas are only fifty dollars a box, so that doesn't it doesn't do much to cut out the megas. I just do that to make sure. Um, you know, we got a chance to get some good stuff in there, but um, I keep the Megas in there. That way, everyone gets something that's not just a base chrome. Um, you know, if, that way, if you kind of strike out on Sapphire, maybe you can still get something in the Megas. But it would have to be, we'd either have to cut out, um, we'll have to cut out either Hobby or Sapphire. I only did 11 Megas this time, so, Yeah. Fodolo, Javier, and White in our auto in box five. Ha! Ha ha! Ask and you shall receive! Another guy on my list of always pulling, Anthony Volps. There you go, Abe. Myself. I have to clean up while I work. It's uh, something that's been ingrained in me from my restaurant days. What were you uh, looking to get for it? the Volpe spot? I'd have to think a couple hundred bucks, right? Honestly, there's a couple guys I can tell you. If you get in my break, I don't know if it's just the run of boxes that we got or if it's I just have good luck with them. It's Volpe, Xavier Edwards, um, Glenn Allen Hill. Who else do I pull a lot of that has an auto spot? Oh, um, Miguel Vargas, um, there's one or two others. I, I literally always drill those guys, just over and over and over and over again. Obviously, Janord, um, but he doesn't have a 150, 1 to 150 spot in this, but, um, which Rodriguez are we looking at? Troy. I don't know if there's more than one Rodriguez auto in the set, but oh, okay. I thought we got the uh, a three card pack again. That's a good idea. I like that. Two jumbos instead of a hobby. Instead of the five hobbies. I just uh, I usually pick the hobbies just because um you get more numbered stuff in there. The jumbos, it seems to be at least like from the, what we've done is uh, the jumbos are just very very heavy with base autos, so the hobby gives a a ton of um, a ton of color. It seems like even though the two uh, two rounds we've done haven't been great, I think we only got one numbered one last time, and, but two this time, both to fifty. So, but I do like that idea. That's a that's a way to save some some dollar dollar bills. All right, box six here on Sapphire. Sejas, Bennett, Duran, Bart, Manning, Waters, Cantillo, Howard, Jung, Little, Rutledge, Schmidt, White, Smith, Bojarski, Gore, Luciano, De La Cruz, Pena, Abrams, Stott. There's another Luis Robert. I think our second one. Robinson, Liberator, Freeman, McConnell, Lodolo, and Javier. No numbered card in this box. Henderson, Groshans, Astudio, and... Oh, my God. Wow. Lucky day, Brennan Davis spot. Yeah, I was kind of confused there, Troy. I was like, who does he have? It's Rodriguez. It's like, <laughs> you, Benny the Jet Rodriguez, right? But very nice. Second Brennan Davis auto. Who's got the Brennan Davis spot? You guys 
guys gotta go and just take uh, some spots in soccer for me right now, please? Because I really want to open more soccer stuff. I very much enjoyed uh, enjoyed that. I got this select sitting back here that I'm just like dying to open. Got an auto with a Poisson on top of it. Oh! Come on, numbered card, where are you at? I don't want to go back to back without a numbered, but we did. I don't think there were any three cards, uh, three card packs in that one either. But eh, sometimes it happens. Like I said, uh, I think it's four out of five boxes, odds wise, get you a number card. So uh, Zach Brown, Daz Cameron, Braylon Marquez, Denenberg, Hankins, Madrigal, Levine, Witt, very nice. Kirilov, Vargas, Florial, Jones, Green, Allen, Whitley, Hose, Encarnacion, Hayes, Laura, Sejas, Gilbert, uh, Girod, Waters, Jung, Tavares, Nova, Little, and White. All right, Nick Bennett, Matt Manning, Plas, and ah, this is another guy. I knew there was someone else that I was couldn't remember. It's like I pulled a ton of his autos. Jackson Rutledge, same thing with Joe Ryan. Those are the guys. Pull so much Jackson Rutledge. I think that's uh that's yours too, isn't it, Abe? Told you you had a better random than you thought, buddy. I know it wasn't one of the uh, the top top guys, but. I saw how Ryan, Rutledge, and Volpe on there. I was like, all right, this guy's going to get like 13 autos this round, I think. All right, halfway mark. Got to get some more Dominguez's for Troy. Yeah, I thought so, Abe. I thought you had uh, Rutledge. I was gonna ask you. I was gonna ask you about that spot. You know, like I don't, I don't need more cards in my life. But then again, I, I just continue to buy cards, so I don't know. I don't know. Another no auto or uh, no parallel box. Green, Perez, Manning, Waters, Lynch, Lutz, Jung, Little, Edwards, Cardenas, White, Smith, Rutherford, Casas, Luciano, De La Cruz, Manoa, Adele, Stott. There's Luis. So our third Robert. Maybe we could have a Dominguez coming up. Gorman, Varland, Astudio, Freeman, Kalenic, Hill, McConnell, Sanchez, Ramos, and Blade. No such luck. All right. Bennett and Connor Cannon. So that's going to go to the draftable auto spot. Connor Cannon. So a little bit light on draftable autos this time. Last time we had uh, 10 or 11. Right now we're sitting at 3. <laughs> that's like as bad as it gets. I mean, like it's good to hit cards, right, Troy? Like it's nice, but... I think you might be right, uh, Kev. I feel like I said Nick Bennett and um, who's the other one? Or someone else, too. I think it might have been this combo, Lynch and Lutz. I feel like in every box. I don't know, though. I'm always surprised when I uh, finish sorting stuff like this. Because there's always, you know, there's every time, just because, you know, it's such a small sample size, there'll be, like, you know, one or two guys that only have, like, two or three cards, which sucks. But, um... Then there's always, like, one or two guys where it's like, how the hell did I pull, oh, like, 11 copies out of 15 boxes? How did that happen? It's never Dominguez or Robert, although last time, uh, I think it was very successful for all the big spots. I think we had no less than five. I think the Laura, Laura spot had six. That was the lowest one, maybe. 
or no, the Poisson spot, but hit it hit an auto. That's what it was. Poisson only had like two or three sapphires, but it's the auto. So, man, another no parallel box. Give me one second here, guys. Two. No, right amount of cards. I'm just checking to see if I've been missing that, if it's been like the uh, the three card packs that we've noticed in the past, but just, nope, just a little unlucky here. All right, Volpe, Gil, Chisholm, Diaz, Ryan, Hall, Gonzalez, Adaman, Pache, Hernandez, Mata, Garcia. There we go. Second JD for Troy. Congrats, buddy. J-Rod, Adams, Montero, Valamont, Miller, Shortridge, Mitchell, Ashby, Cruz, Garcia, Vaughn, Thomas, Franco, Mateo, Anderson, Welker, and Ruiz. No Nick Bennett. <laughs> Damian Jones, and... There you go. I don't know if you're watching, Chris. Chris had uh, Dominguez last time. He said, oh, I only got one, one first Bowman auto on the checklist this time. He asked me to get him Dominguez again, but obviously, you know, I got to spread the love. But I still hooked him up with the Yankees first, and now he gets an auto. So. Ooh, pulling Adele. You mean the Adele? Pad Paracha? I'd like to get a pad. A little Terry Bradshaw parallel. No problem, Troy. I'd like to get you at least two more of those. Give you a nice uh, you know, $1,500 day here. Just want a parallel. Where are our parallels? Yeah, Pereira's a nice one. Definitely a nice one. Happy with that. No parallel again. Definitely something that happened in the, uh, the past is uh, we've run through like four or five boxes in a row. Uh, I think I'm going to do it, Kev. Um, I just got to wait for, for price, and no one's there over the weekend, so I don't know what the price is. Um, is going to be. So uh, I'm waiting for them to, to hear back from them before I decide. Just because uh, it's a little bit difficult sometimes with those breaks where it's, um, uh, what's it called? Not everyone's going to get something, like the high-risk breaks. So I think I'm going to do it. Um, I just want to hear back on them to see if there's anything they can do with pricing before I, uh, before I decide. All right. Box 10? Box 10. Thomas, Franco, Groshans, Lodolo, Welker, Ruiz, Javier, Chisholm, Cavico, Balazovic, Diaz, Gonzalez, Baum, Davis, Mata, Garcia, Swaggerty, Rollison, Adams, Montero, Gray, Lewis, Shortridge, Mitchell, Sanchez, Marquez, Jones, and Garcia. Liberator, Henderson, Gill, and <laughs> I told you. I done told you. I pull out the Joe Ryan cards. What, 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 what? All right. Final five boxes. We got to get some more numbered autos. Final five boxes, then we'll do the, uh, the random. As of now, I think we have seven seven spots. Top card looking like it's about 80 bucks or so. Yeah, I thought so too. Kev, I thought the uh, the price was good, but the product like that that's older, um, I don't really always know. I'm not like, I don't do any of the pricing or anything for the company for the website for stuff like that. So I have no idea if, uh, you know, how that price is compared to uh, like some of the newer stuff where I kind of know what map pricing is and the current market on stuff that sells uh, a little bit more frequently. So, 
I always like to just double check. And sometimes with availability too, um, I want to just make sure it's something that's still, I mean, the company, we always want to sell stuff. I mean, if it's on the site, we're going we're gonna to sell it. But I just always, I always just like to ask. Because I never know what, uh, especially with high-end products like that, again, that are old, we might not have a ton. And for all I know, they might be working a deal with someone right now to sell that. So I don't want to, you know, impede anything that is uh, already in the works. Now, if it's a case of, like, Topps Heritage 2020, I know we have enough, you know? Does that make sense? Hey, we got a parallel. But, yeah, it looked like it would come out to about 40, 40-ish dollars a spot, roughly. Um, no, there's a ton of good names, though, in, in 2016. I mean, people forget, like, when we were just going through a... Uh, Optic, I, I forgot that there's so many good players in there. Um, and you have some top-tier guys. I mean, I would call Prescott. I mean, he's not Lamar, or, you know, uh, or Mahomes level, but Prescott and Elliott are up there. Those, I mean, those are two pretty solid names. Um, and then there's just a lot of a lot of real just solid, solid NFL players. I mean, a lot of all pros too. So, and the good news is because uh, NT's a end of the year product they have everyone. So, you know, the early sets that are missing guys like Tyreek Hill, he's in there. So you have all those guys, which is nice. But, all right, back to Bowman. Box 11. Good luck, guys. Uh, Astudio, Freeman, Beck, Mize, Sanchez, Joe Ryan, Kate, Cabello, Hall, Pache, Brown, Cameron, Hernandez, Dominguez. Boom. Saw that one coming. I know that little run of guys. The Pache, starting with Pache right here. Hall, Pache, Hernandez, Dominguez, like Stone Cold Lock. These guys just always right after another. Uh, Hankins, Madrigal, Rodriguez, Valmont, Kirloff, Vargas, Ashby, Cruz, Encarnacion, and Hayes. Garcia, Hoke, McConnell, and Brady Singer. 64 or 75. Brady Singer. Riley Green, Nick Allen, Owen Miller, and <laughs> I was going to say I pull a lot of Aaron Shortridge too, but I haven't pulled one in a while. This is the guy I was drilling in the uh, hobby cases just nonstop early on. Aaron Shortridge. People are like, oh, I got the Pirates. That sucks. They only have one auto in literally every every case. Aaron Shortridge, Aaron Shortridge, Aaron Shortridge. But it's been a while for, uh, for him. So I believe he is a... Uh, No, he is in the set. He's in the set. Someone's got the Aaron Shortridge spot. He's in the he's in the set, right? Yeah, he definitely is. What was it? Who was it? The uh, the book. Ken. I'm assuming it was this year's NT. All right, no numbered card again. Schmidt, Bojarski, Volpe, Gill, Gore, Pena, Thomas, Franco, Abrams, Robinson, Welker, Ruiz, Henderson, Groshans, Baum, Davis, Lodolo, Javier, Swaggerty, Rollison, Chisholm, Diaz, Gray, and Lewis. Where are numbered autos? Where are numbered anythings? Come on. You're better than this, Sapphire. Cavico, Balazovic, Liberator, and Ken Waldachuk. Very interesting guy. Uh, I love his stats. I just love looking at them. Strikeout to walk ratio, 7. 49 Ks in 29 innings. Love it. So that's going to go to the draftable spots. So we're now up to 8. Three boxes left here. Before I go and start sorting my life away, I actually have to finish eBay auctions. 14 more of those to list, or 15 more to list, and then I start sorting my life away.
here are the numbered cards. Now we are striking out on numbered cards, guys. Pereira, Langelier, Swaggerty, Rollison, Kraus, Wilson, Gray, Lewis, Thompson, Amaya, Sanchez, Marquez, Bishop, Huff, Denneberg, Levine, Beck, Mize, Bobby Witt, Poisson coming, Floriel, Hoke, Kate, Hose, Laura, Cabello, Brown, Sejas, and Bennett. I meant uh, Laura. They're the ones that run together. Duh, buff. Mixing stuff up now. Jones, Whitley, Garcia, and... Oh, there's a numbered card. In the draft, Eric Rivera for the Angels, 2 of 50, going into the draft. So, top two picks in the draft are going to be going home with uh, Sapphire Green Autos, most likely. That's nice. Box 14. That's a numbered card. Finally. And it's a good color. It's got a red. Let's go. And we got a Laura, which means we probably got a Wit. I feel like we've been running through the uh, the same players here, in uh, honestly in the uh, the Sapphire stuff. Marquez, Denneberg, Singer, Mauricio, Levine. There's Wit, Apostle, Pereira, Floriel, Jones, Langliers, Kraus, Whitley, Hose, Wilson, Thompson, Laura, Sejas, Amaya, Bishop, Bennett, Manning, Huff, and Beck. I think I'm gonna do the auto first. I think the red is more intriguing. All right, Pearson, Dunning, Sanchez, and Cooper Johnson getting drafted. All right, big red coming up. Big red, Mize, Garcia, and Waters. Let's see what position it is. Shortstop. Shortstop. That's a nice one. Royce Lewis. That is a good hit. 3 of 15. Oh, damn. That's a good card, Kenneth. Wow. I mean, not as sick as this Royce Lewis red to 15. But still pretty good, I guess. It's got that Dwayne Haskins on there, which, you know... Very nice card, though. Congrats to the Royce Lewis spot there. Uh, I think we're up to about nine. Nine or so. All right? Ten? One, two, three, four, five. Ten. So we have ten spots in the draft so far. So max, is we're going to have eleven. So max draft is going to be eleven. So much less than last time. guys final box amaya bishop welker ruiz huff beck cavico balzovich mize garcia bomb davis cabello brown sanchez marquez 
Cameron, Hankins, Zanenberg, Levine, Madrigal, Kirilov, Witt, and Floriel. Swaggerty, Rollison, and Hoke. Nolan Jones, Orange, 52-75. Our final auto. Gray, Lewis, Kate, and one time something big. Our second Alvaro Sejas auto. One regular, one Sapphire. So quick recap here. Let me uh, separate these real fast. So in addition to all the Sapphire stuff that I'm going to show, actually I'll do it at the end. I'll show the Sapphire stuff first here. So, All right, so these are our better base from the top uh, four guys. You got Witt, Laura, Witt, Laura, Witt, Dominguez, Dominguez, Robert, Poisson, Laura, Witt, Robert, Laura, Poisson, Dominguez, Witt, Robert, Laura. Parallels, the 20 of Austin Beck, the 15 of Royce Lewis, 75 of Volpe, Balazovic, Hill, Singer, and Nolan Jones. Autos, Cantillo, Arias, Davis, Volpe, another Davis, Rutledge, Ryan, Pereira, Shortridge, and Sejas. Um, autos being used for the draft. Cooper Johnson, Eric Rivera Green, Waldachuk, Connor Cannon, Joe Janord Green, and a Brendan Shoemake Mega Box. And then the only ho uh, highlights from Hobby were a Ruben Cardenas Gold Auto to 50 and a Bobby Dahlbeck Insert Auto to 50. Um, oh, and an Anthony Volpe Orange Non Auto. That was the uh, the highlights of, of that stuff. There was another Orange, too. Jesus Sanchez Mega Box, I think. But um, that's going to do it for the break. So let's go ahead and switch on over and. I'm going to need a second here. i got to reorganize the list. And we'll do the random to figure out what 11 people are going to be participating in the draft. Give me a minute here, guys, and we'll take care of that. This is going to be faster. Almost done.
Okay. So what we're going to do instead is instead of me reorganizing the list because it's a pain in the butt to do it on the sheet that I have here, I'm going to switch you guys over. So what I did was I just uh, we got a list of numbers 1 through 150. So um, what I'll do is the top 11 spots, um, I'm just going to match them up with the um, the original spots. So if spot number 122 lands on top, I'm just going to go back to the original list, and then whoever had spot 122 will have the first pick. So I'll do that live right now. Um, let me just get, I'll get a set up here for the... I'll just do it live. I'll match it up with you guys here. But all right, here we go. Seven times. Seven times. So one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. So spot 88 going to be first. So that's Chris. Second pick is spot 13, which is card chasing. Nice. Third was... 147, Manny, four, it's 40 and five is one, Mount Buderak, I think I'm just gonna have to look for one. Bean Man was one, spot one. Number six is 18, and seven is 64. Laper. Kelly, number eight, 54 and then 16, Jay Frey, BX Baseball, And our last two in the draft is going to be 57 39. Cardinals fan and B. Buckert. All right. Boom. All right, so there's our draft order. No problem, Jeff. Uh, thank you guys so much for uh, joining and watching. I got some uh, eBay stuff I have to do. Um, you guys can go ahead and start with the draft. I'll post up the items um, as first thing here. Um, first thing I'm going to do. That way you guys can go ahead and get started. Um, but yeah, uh, if anyone has any questions, you just let me know. I'll do my best to get everything um, sorted and possibly shipped tomorrow. We'll see. I don't know. Um, I'm... I'm gonna say it's probably gonna be Tuesday though so I'll let you guys know though in the thread so enjoy the rest of your weekend everybody and I'm out <laughs>